morning to you ladies, my name is Jack Step the Guy, and welcome to the final season of Telltale's The Walking Dead. We're gonna finish off Clementine's story in this season. Now this is just episode one, it came out a few days ago. And I've been putting it off a small bit because I've been trying to figure out a way to get my saves to work. But they don't, because I'm in a different place, I'm using a different computer and everything, so the save file that I once had isn't updating here. For some reason, I don't know why I've been trying to get it to work and I can't. I've been on the website and everything, so I don't know how this is going to work. If I can just go in and pick some choices from before and just kind of pad out the story the way I did it. I don't know. I wish it just had a list to be like, well, if you don't have a save from last time, you can pick the choices that you did last time. I don't know, but I'm just going to get in and start the episode anyway because I've been very, very excited about this. And there's only four episodes in this one, which is unusual because... Telltale games normally have five episodes, but we're playing as older Clementine, and now I forget your name. What was his name? Oh, I can't remember. The, the little boy that we were all sad about, so let's start episode one. Episode one's called Done Running. When the dead started walking, I was small and alone. I need to turn on Until subtitles. Until a man named Lee became Lee! I miss you, Lee! God, season one was so good. It made me cry like a little baby. Lee protected other people, too. But he couldn't save everyone. Oh. Oh, God. Am I going through everything? God, season one was like five, six years ago. I can't remember what I did. But I think I saved Carly. You can never save everyone. Sorry, Doug. The living were just as dangerous as the dead. A woman so in our group named Lily lost her dad, and then she just couldn't cope. She took the life that Lee saved. Yep. <laughs> I think this is so quintessential. Uh, telltale right now is like Lee saved someone, the other person died, but it's there. Yeah, the next scenario, the other person died again, anyway. <laughs> um, I don't think I let her stay with us. I think when that happened, I played this by the way before I even did YouTube. Season one, I played way like a good bit before I actually started doing YouTube stuff like full time. So, th this series isn't up on the channel anywhere. So, I, I left Lily behind at that point. Lee left her on the side of the road. Lee taught me how to survive. He protected me as long as he could. But he got bit. Because of me. It wasn't because of and you, Clem. in the end, he was still teaching. Always keep moving. Stay away from cities. Keep your hair short. I think I said to keep your hair short because I thought it was a cute thing that he said at the end. Keep that hair short. Just no. not worth the risk. Because he had just cut her hair before Lee that. Wouldn't make it. He knew it was the end. He made one final request. And when I played this, I shot him and I cried my eyes out. He asked me to shoot him. And I did. It was super sad. I met I another group after that. I didn't want to let him turn. People. Running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. AJ. AJ, that was it. But the mom didn't. Yum yum snack time. And I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. We thought he was gone forever. That was the last straw for Kenny. And without Lee around, I had to make the call. Oh! No, th so this series went up on the channel. And I shot Kenny. And then I also cried my eyes out. <laughs> I stopped Kenny. A lot of people were not happy with that decision Finally when I did gave it. gave him peace. It turned out AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Knowing what they'd done, I still stayed with Jane. I went on a lot. Didn't I stay with Jane? And then she ended up hanging herself. 
Again, Telltale course correcting itself. I still decided we were better together. Yeah. For AJ's sake. Mm hmm. I remember that. But like everything else, it wouldn't last. AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. Oh. I thought we'd found something that worked, but I was wrong again. They took AJ from me, said I was too young to take care of him. I, I let him be taken, didn't I? I left because I wanted him to just be happy. I thought maybe they were right. I said my goodbyes. I regretted it later. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. We're searching together now. Yay! The place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. Look at you Just go! Like did for me. Okay, so I think I actually picked the choices that I picked when I did it the first time anyway. It's weird how there was a lot of them in the first episode and then the second and third one was like, oh, you picked one thing and now we move on to this story. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored to how you play. As always, Jack will remember that. Okay, before I go anywhere else, let me uh, turn on subtitles. I don't know why they're just not on by default. And I'll make the medium so you guys at home can all see them. Okay, good. Are you ready? Let's go. Final season. Clementine. Let's get into it. Hi, friend. There she is! Clementine, you can drive? Oh, cute boy! Oh, she's AJ in her hand! What you doing there, goofball? Pretending we got bullets. <laughs> well, don't. It's getting on my nerves. God, you're so much older! I don't like goofball. I'm too big for it. How about shitbird? <laughs> yes! Huh, so I guess you're all grown up now. Yep. Well, let me drive. I'm not letting you drive. <laughs> I wonder what ages they're supposed to be. What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. Give magazine, give toy. I don't want to give a toy. He just said he was growing up and he was all happy about it. So I'm going to give him a magazine. Here, practice your reading. Ha, huh, dope. But I don't want to. It'll take your mind off your stomach. Preheat oven. Place cream, vanilla be beans, into a saucepan and bring to a boy. Uh, on second thought, never mind. That's only gonna make you hungrier. Ooh, give snack. Here you go. About all we got. Sweet Cheetos. What about you? Go for it. We'll find something else soon. I believe you. Oh. Clementine needs a bath. <laughs> okay, Nito. Getting a lot of like Joel and Ellie vibes. It's just the genders are reversed for the age differences. But I am curious to know how old Clementine's supposed to be in this. Is she still like a teen or is she early 20s or. She looks like she's about mid to late teens. I don't know. We gonna do it? Think so. Looks clear. We're doing it. 
Whoa. Friendly, ring bell. No trespassing. We friendly. Huh, what do I want to bring? Do I want to bring the toy? Or the canteen? Or... Let's look at the toy. Awesome. They got it has a bullet hole in it though, so maybe that says something. We need water too. Always gotta get your water. Come on, Jimmy! Even though you're a crowbar, not a Jimmy bar, but whatever. Oh, back out. Man, who knew when the zombie apocalypse happened, it was gonna suck all the color out of the world as well. Alright. Find some food. Hmm. Oh, is this even a good idea? Friendly, ring the bell. What does it mean? It's a trap. It means the people here shoot first. I mean, if you're dodging walkers, then if you ring that bell, won't it like alert all of them? Maybe that's the way of saying it. Like, if you're friendly, we won't shoot you. Ring the bell, and then the zombies show up and eat you anyway. Master the crowd. Ooh. Never haven't never had this kind of perspective before. AJ, come on! You're gonna get swiped. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. What do we do? AJ, stay back. Oh hell yeah. Claim's about to go to work. Eat to stun or Q to kill. Nice. She still has the tactic of kicking it in the leg first. That's it's cool. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. Next, we get in there. Awesome. I like AJ. Don't take him away from me again. Oh, you want to get pushed in the swing? Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. You swing on it. For fun? F uh, you get in on? the tire and someone pushes you so that you go really high. Oh, huh. I wanna try. After we clear this place. Smart boy. Alright. I'll push you in a little minute there, AJ. Is it cool if I call you Adj? Hmm, interesting. Is it? <laughs> what did I do? You've collected Deer Skull, a possible hood ornament. Ah. You can pit my right, I can just. The Walking Dead, West Coast Customs. We do have a crowbar. Oh, unless there's another way in and this is gonna make a lot of noise. What do we do inside a new place? We listen for monsters. After that? Come on, you remember. We... Inside a new place? Check we the windows. Check, the, check windows. the windows. Yes! That's right. Cause you gotta see if anybody else is coming in or can go out or escape plans and all that kind of stuff. <gasps> oh god. Huh. Monsters. All tied up. They can't get us? <sighs> no, they can't. Hmm. Windows are all boarded up. Your choices will determine what he will become. 
So what I do to people determines how AJ turns out? Oh no, it's like real parenthood. Can't pry that open. I know you're hungry. I am too. So are the zombies. I promise. Just eat zombie meat. That's fine. It's just a little raw. Enter the ticket booth. Bet this opens the lock. Ah! That's not happening. Okay, what if I kill you first? <laughs> Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. Did they kill themselves? Poison. Did they give up? They wanted to leave this world together. Holding hands in their own home. Will we have a home? We'll see. <laughs> Optimism. <laughs> okay, you said to leave you alone though, as in, this is what you wanted, that you wanted to die, but I don't think you wanted to be sitting here forever as zombies. Do we get the key? Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. That's right. Smart? Can we just grab the key? I mean, it's right there. You just get AJ to stand over there and the zombies will all be distracted and you grab the key and go. It's easy peasy. <laughs> okay, we'll find another way. Beans! Oh, oh, made Beans! Might be more where this came from. Hell yeah! You have a jar of beans. I've got a jar of dirt. It's promising. They ate well. For their last meal. And that's why they stink. Hey, Age! What's going on? Hungry boy? What just happened? You can fit through that, right? You're a tiny Too little man. Well, for me. And the key or the window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill the monsters. They're not people. Well, they used to be people, and as people, they asked to be left alone. So what's best? Oh God. I have determine, to determine how AJ turns out. He wants to kill the people, and they did say that they wanted to be left alone, but they wanted to be left alone as people. They wanted to die their own way, which is fine. Totally respect that, but we do need a key. And this is not something anybody should have to go through, just sitting there, monsters forever. Could send him inside, it might be formative for him, he just has to go in and get the door. I don't know! I'm a send- uh... I want to send him inside, but what if one shows up and then he gets scared forever? Or he gets hurt? Kill the couple. I'll get the key. I empathize with people, sorry. but you're not people anymore. And this is better for you. You can actually rest in peace this way. Come on. Stab us with a pig. Good job. Thanks, Age. <sighs> Sorry, it had to go this way. They they died how they wanted. This doesn't count. You didn't do anything wrong, Clem. Is that more food? Huh. They had a good 
thing going here. Can we stay here? We'll see. <laughs> that no always means no. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. I'm here, kiddo. I know. Are you saying I'm not someone? That's not what I mean. <laughs> she likes to sprint after things, doesn't he? Yes! Just a few. Remember what we said? You know this. Save the last bullet for yourself, Jesus! Always, Always aim for the head. <laughs> That's right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something we can eat. Who picked that up? That's so. so morbid. It would, it would take me, wouldn't it? Good old Jacksepticeye, always trying to find the positives. Even in the zombie apocalypse, I'm always trying to find the positives. Okay. See, what I want to do for him is to make him feel validated and important, and that what he's doing is actually... <sighs> Spoiled. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. Language! Fuck is right, watch the swears. Watch hey, the swears. Watch the swears. I meant shoot. <laughs> I appreciate your maturity, but God, this reminds me of um this little room reminds me of a section in The Road. It's like one of the few books I've actually read. If you've ever seen the movie, it has Viggo Mortensen in it, but the in the book they find like a security bunker area that's full of like water and stuff. And they fill up on water until their bellies are full and aching. And at that time, I was like so hungry on my trip home from college on the bus that I, I could just imagine what it was like. Something under here. Give us a help, little kiddo. Never mind. I am She-Hulk. Floor door? Huh? Yeah. I must have wanted to hide something. Floor door. Oh yeah. Oh, cue it up. This is exactly like the road. Jackpot. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. Oh, shit. It's rigged. No! <laughs> AJ. Tatas. That's bad. Oh, that's real bad. Monsters. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go, Clem. Oh, we didn't get to do the tire swing. Oh, shoot. We need to get back to the car. Just push him on the tire swing once. to do. Stick to the sides and be my eyes while I clear a path. Oh, what a good kid. It also said that he was a great shot. Oh god, oh god, is he? No god, oh god! Get off me! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! AJ! You okay? Get to the car. Get to the chopper. <laughs> AJ, help! Oh my god, no! His eye came out! Oh, I the guy! Oh, gross! <laughs> Go, go! What's in his face? Okay, handbrake, there we go. And key, go! Oh, he has the key in his eye! Oh, shit! Oh, God, we first person now. Oh, fuck. 
AJ! Nice. Okay. Oh, God! Thanks, bud! Jesus Christ. Hi! Okay, thanks for the push, fellas! So screwed! Damn, you're a beat! The windscreens don't shatter like that, by the way. Give me the knife! This sucks! There you go. AJ, buckle up! Buckle the fuck up, dude! Get off me, get off me! I am hammering this button and nothing is happening! Oh my god, Th Whoa. This went from zero to a hundred real quick. Oh, hi. Jesus. What a nice smile you have. Oh, God, my heart. That was tense. Ah, Telltale Presents. Good start, man. It seems like they changed some of the engine stuff, too. The visuals seem a bit better. I still wish I had a bit more color in it, but I, I get what they're going for with the color grading and the fact that it's the apocalypse and everything's supposed to look miserable. Oh god, I didn't mean to pause. I'm sorry. I'm taken away from it. Please, please don't. Please no copyright claims. <laughs> Because I, I go and kind of black out for these games, so I don't know how long after the other season this is supposed to be. That's why in the beginning I'm like, I don't know what age you are. I don't know when this takes place. I know it takes place after, but I don't know when. Because I just don't want any spoilers or anything for them. I like to go in bland. Speaking of blind, I have something in my eye. <laughs> Look at you, fancy hair. Yep, that seems about right. Ha. Your outfit is great. I would like that outfit. Those boots are What is this place? I also really like this new like over the shoulder kind of gameplay. A Phil Woozy. Where the hell am I? Good quest, Oaklam. Memories. Oh, BFFs. That stands for big fat friendship. I don't think wherever we are is very dangerous. It would just be nice to know where we are so I don't freak out and get all paranoid.
You did a you did a weird sound for that. Am I supposed to know what this is? Oh. Short people problems, right, Clem? Not that I would know. I'm eight foot tall. Okay, stand stand on chair. There you go. That's using your noodle. This will do. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, that's it? Oh man, I thought we were gonna find something that had to do with the people who were here. She's a badass. I wanna be like Clem when I grow up. Hey, it's the, the S on strong there in the middle. That's the one that everyone draws in secondary school. Seriously, is there dicks in my eye or something? Get out of there. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, maybe not. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. He's gonna be bad, but let's disarm him anyway. Drop the knife now. You do the same. I'm sorry. He will remember that. He We're will be traumatized by that. We've got your boy. He's safe. If you want to see him again, you'll drop that knife now. I'm not fucking around. Uh, me either. I, I, I was just trying to defend myself. I'll drop the knife. No problem, man. How about we all drop our knives? Your turn. Good. That's good. See? All good here. Look, if we wanted to hurt you, we would have by now. Considering the circumstances, I'll let this That's little shit off slide. But you only get one strike. Now, you're gonna behave so I can take you to see your boy? He's a burned face. Because if you really want to fight... Truth. Now please, just take me to see him. Alright, since you asked so nicely. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You had to take precautions, you know, just in case. That's fine. You're safe now. And so is your friend. I'm Marlin. That's Tennessee. But, uh, call him Ten for short. He's one bit taking care of you. He uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Come on. Let's go see your boy. <gasps> Connor? The android sent by Cyberlife? I wish, or I hope that I get to see Jesus again in this. He was my favorite character in the last season. He was pretty cool, and everything he said sounded like he had purpose. I want to see him again. He was dope. A1 sauce? A-yay? My god, lack of color. So you've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? You could say I usually see people our age alone out in the wild. Sure, I do what I can to get by. No matter what. Hey, don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. Hi. It's good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Everyone here is so the young. Were on the, way. the car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? <laughs> Not a pleasant thought. 
I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there. Okay. <laughs> What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you in ever. Anything what like is this you? place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and a good location, too. No one really comes out this way anymore. No adults. At all. It wasn't always like this, though. People leave, they die. There's less of us all around. <laughs> the flag is a shirt. I got us a system in place <laughs> that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Ericsson's boarding school for troubled youth. Oh, it's like X-Men! And your boy feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit troubled. AJ and I are angels. I was pretty good as a kid before everything changed. Made a lot of trouble since then. We all had to grow up fast. I'd say that goes double for your boy. It's been a little terror since he arrived. Oh no. Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Oh shit. I need to take care of this. Then please, by all means, keep no, yelling! Really, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. I think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. <laughs> Get a move on, Willie! And where's your damn weapon? Hi. So Lewis is the guy who listens to music. Got it. Okay. That girl on the fence, she's the one who's able to sense your emotions. And that guy, he's the leader, which means he's probably got super strength or something. You know, typical X-Men stuff. Follow the music. Check. You can clean up a small bit. All right, you got guests. Gah, you little motherfucker! Hey. Hi. Hey. Uh, about time you woke up. Your little boy just bit me. He oh shit! Took a boot shit. To his head. Nearly took a chunk out of me. I'm so sorry. He acts out sometimes. He's been through a lot. Yeah, well, ain't we all? Don't see any of us sinking our teeth into either of you. <laughs> boy needs to learn some respect. R-E-S-P-E-C-T, I get it, okay? Maybe you need to just learn boundaries and distances. I'm guessing I'm going the right way, then. <laughs> Clem! Oh, okay? They're so cute! I love them! They're mine now. I was afraid you were... Ticklish. I'm okay. And you know what you are? What? Ticklish. <laughs> oh no, my heart! But, AJ, listen to me. That girl out there says you bit her. Is that true? Yeah. Answer me, AJ. Did you bite her? I didn't mean to. She snuck up on me. Still, no more bites. No more bites. I learned it from watching them. You're not dead. That's good. <gasps> Watch your kid for you. Jaden Smith. My name is AJ. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. No problem. Well, not no problem. He was a bit of a handful. But I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. <laughs> AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. <laughs> Loud and clear, little man. Don't ever do it. Okay. Thankfully, I'm serious. I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Clementine. I'm Lewis, oh, and I'm sexy. Yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. Nice. 
I mean knife. There we go. That's the claim we know. Um, double, um, <laughs> does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude, that can't be a good idea. <laughs> that thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. I'll guarantee he's a better shot than you. Hey. You guys do your thing, I guess. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. Jesus. But you're armed. Damn it. Oh, we're all, my we're all armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Clementine. You are lost and gone forever. Sing it. Sing it, Lewis. Uh, I love that song. Dreadful sorry, Clementine. Yeah, sing to me, like Lewis. Sing to me. And like a fairy, and her shoes were number nine. Herring boxes without topses. Sandals were for Clementine. Clementine. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. <laughs> Loud is bad. Not always. Exactly. Compressor Loud is, is not always bad. Come on. This one right here. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Have a little fun in your life. But I can see where he's coming from. It's like you gave the kid who just bit someone a gun. Now press this one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey. Hello. You seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. We've got a bit of a situation out there. Um, <clears throat> hate to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? Hell yeah, I'm armed. You too, Lewis. Get your ass in gear. <sighs> Fine. Oh, these are artists' piano hands, not murderer hands. I am not a killer. I am an artiste. Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. We need our help to clear the way. Okay. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple of days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. Bitch! What? Just saying, there's got to be some explanation. Look, I didn't know any of that was going to happen. Sorry if it caused you guys problems. Uh, um. <clears throat> Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. <laughs> what he said. All right, boys and girls, they're starting to fill in. Come on. Let's go, soldiers! Don't mind Violet. Two on she the out. double! Grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. <laughs> this is my knife. I call it Andrew. <laughs> Clay, let me help. I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. I like that that trust is already there. Like, immediately she gave him the gun right at the start of the game to be like, no, this is how it is. He's good. He's reliable. Go, Charles! Charles Xavier! Thanks, Norman. Dun, 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 dun. Time for Batman to go to work. Bat Clem! Yeah! Whoa! Heaven's the best. <laughs> Turn around covered in blood. Thanks! Could use a little more finesse, though. Watch and learn. Hey, over here. Follow me. And that's how you school a walker. 
There's that. a whole bunch of traps laying around this area for these ass hats. They're all marked, so keep a lookout. That seems like overkill. And now you gotta redo these every time. I mean, cool. If I get to do it, then that's pretty badass. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, the screen fills up on red, the direction they're in. All right, where's this trap? What does this trap do? I don't know, cut the rope! Walking on range, damn it! Fuck, 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 fuck. No walker in range, what? Ah, shit, shit, shit! Dead. Thank you. Thank you for that. Okay, I I messed up. There's a whole bunch of traps laying around this area for these ass hats. They're all okay. marked, so keep a lookout. Okay. Walker not in range. Walker Texas Ranger. Okay, cut the rope. Boom, baby. Can you back up again? <laughs> ah, catch up. All right, for this guy. No, come on! I pressed E. Okay. All right, so I have to do the traps because I pressed E to like kick their leg, and nothing happened. Area for these ass hats. They're all marked, so keep a lookout. Okay, I'm gonna do this one first then. Nice. Let's see if I can get to this one in time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on. Damn it! This is bullshit of the highest order. Ooh, mama! That was pretty cool. Okay, why am I like the only one here? Also, that other one should have killed two. I'm just saying. There we go. Looks like they made it back in one piece. Come on. Halfway. Right at the borderline, where I'm going away for you. Oh. Ah, there's too many of them. Can I just run around you guys? Does that work? Or some of you come in here into this area? Yes. Just like that, fellas. Yes. Very good. Aha. And for you, this, and we got it! Oh god, that was delayed. That scared me. Okay. And you're doing, gonna do the gang up on me, and I'm no oh, and now I can press Q all day. There we go. Clementine is ruthless! Yo, over here! Nice timing. We're not gonna be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk more about that? inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. Hi, Violet. Oh, someone's gonna die, aren't they? You know, you're not half bad, considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. You got it, Violet! That's a bad shot by that guy, okay? Sorry, Mildred. Piece of shit. I hate this cleanup bullshit. Whoa, 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 whoa! Dude! Ooh! It's all right, girl. It's all right. Hey, see you and Rosie are making friends. Had a bad experience with the dog ones. Yeah. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. Hey, because dogs can't turn, right? That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right. Fun's over. Let's get inside. We did not. <laughs> I'm fucking starving. You're not the only one. 
Good day's work, go fellas. Here. How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. The safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. <laughs> B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. He likes Don't me. be jealous, Vi. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. You're both delusional. <laughs> Shut up, baby. I know it. Dog. I mean, apart from the whole like Walker blood everywhere. Hey, bud. They're pretty good with the monsters. Come on, y'all. Boots. <laughs> <Ooh. sighs> AJ. <laughs> <sighs> Back's to goddamn wall, huh? <laughs> yeah, you can't really walk up behind him. He's got a thing about that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Painful thing. <laughs> he can't go around punching people in the. No one expect him to eat at the same table. <laughs> I'll talk to him. AJ. Hey. You can't be punching people in the dick anymore, hey. okay? It's not cool. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. That bird's a crow. In school, they told us they're called scavengers. Can you see that? Scavengers. Vagers. Scavengers. Scavengers. It's my favorite movie. What's it mean? Sc it means scavengers Infinity like War. Us. They just eat stuff that's already dead. Huh. Scavengers are gross. Oh, yeah. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. <laughs> AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive you, but we should go talk to them. But... but I don't think they like me. Of I can they just do. tell. They don't. They don't know you, AJ. I'll bet when they do, They'll like you just as much as I do. I don't know. Marlin was really mad. And that girl I bit, she yelled at me. They're She's really scary. Ap apologize. <sighs> AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. <sighs> so we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. Yeah. Help AJ make friends. Okay. Let's let's go talk to Ruby first, since you took a chunk out of her hand. Took your pound of flesh. There's that girl up in. Yeah. Wanna talk to her? You mean say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta. Lay down thick, leave the joke, tell her you were scared. Tell her why you did it. Because of my thing? Yep. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Just be honest. Don't be ashamed of your thing? I mean, it's good advice. It's just this is getting a bit weird. Yes. I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just... I just get scared, and I'm sorry, and I hope your finger is okay. No, oh, sure, it's all right. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Thank you for your honesty and your apology. Yeah. I did it! You sure did. <laughs> Look, Mom, I did it! I said sorry to someone. And now we're best friends. We're gonna write a book together. 
um, talk to these guys. I think maybe talking to Marilyn will progress stuff, maybe? I don't know. What's up, a sim? Hello? Hello? Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm, like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. <laughs> Those who do not learn from the past and all that. It's a journal, okay? Oh! He seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt, which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She... Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. <laughs> Give it back. She was very cute. It was just sitting there. So? Finish that sentence, AJ. Saved my life. I f-worded up and looked like a fool. Oh, not cool. I just I write mistakes down so they won't happen again. I gotta finish this before dinner. Not, not a bad be, idea. Like rude, but you know. Bye. Oh. I wanted him to say like that new girl seems pretty tight. She helped me. And that's dope. Mm, yeah. What's up, hey y'all? Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. Damn. That's not a bad sentence. You can do things or you can do them right. All it takes is a little patience. And you know what? He's absolutely bang on the money. Uh, I don't want to go talk to those other two yet. Marilyn's the leader, so hey it might progress things. Knock it off, Ten. Heard you guys didn't have the best introduction. It wasn't my fault. I really am sorry. Really. I'm sorry, too. What is this? Our graveyard. And you guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody really. This is where we buried ten sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Yeah. Paying respects. F Should we chat. do that too? Maybe? Yeah, I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. I mean, it's not really our place, but... We want to show that we care. And we empathize with your cause. Thank you. Oh. Sweethearts. Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. To talk to Marlin. Okay. I guess I needed to do this anyway. Hey, uh, Marilyn? You got a sec? Clementine, right? I'm Brody. <gasps> Chase! Sweet little fella. We have a Marvin and a Brody He's in this a lot now. Of sweetness still out there. I'm the lucky one. He's just naturally good. Naturally good? That's rare stuff. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? <laughs> I'll think about it. Well, don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done. Sorry, the rest of you don't get to eat. You guys earn your supper after all. It's a big dog. Jesus. Big pit bull boy. Girl. That one kid that stared at me is still weird looking. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. <sighs> Thanks. 
Wow, I can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mm, this is really good. Damn, boy! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Where are your manners, AJ? Good night. Oh, I'm sorry. Good night. Uh, good night! Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. You sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. We oh, God. Good night. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game there is. I don't know the game. The only card game I've played had less people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. It's well, easy. I Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner oh. gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. That's a weird game. And what if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Wait, what about AJ? What about him? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. Come on. Oh. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. But you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. Okay, y'all, you're about to lose. Oh god, a jack. Dang it! Okay, Violet. Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Where are AJ's parents? You two don't really look related, so... What happened there? I can't remember what actually happened to his parents. They're dead. They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. <sighs> For the most part. <laughs> Hey, I win this time. Hey, I win. Hey, you do. So, what do you want to know? How'd you get your hair like that? Ireland's haircut. Met anyone famous? Worst injury witness? Grossest thing eat? Good song. Uh, grossest thing eaten. Okay. Uh, what's the grossest thing you've ever eaten? It's pretty easy. Uh, horse eyeballs. Plus, Ew! Cantaloupe. Come on. Dude, I fucking hate cantaloupe. <laughs> I cantaloupe. ate a guy's leg once. I'm kidding. Are you? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh... Ever have a boyfriend? Oh my god. Because he's a smooth what? operator. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. I haven't, by the way. Oh, I'm sure she's real surprised about that one. Never. Not even once. Never. How would you even have time to, as a kid, to do that kind uh, of thing? I win. So, Clem. You can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? <sighs> you guys gonna open up Family? some fucking wounds? Anyone? My friend Lee. Always Lee! Always go with the Lee answer! The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. <laughs> What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How do I go? How to use a gun? That's sad. 
Dakota say goodbye? Oh, it's gonna make me cry again! I miss Lee! Ugh. I win again. You do indeed. Ask away. Let's <laughs> see about Marilyn's haircut. What's up with your haircut, Marlin? Oh boy. Uh, what do you mean? She means it looks like a dead cat. Probably smells like one too. <laughs> uh, I look cool. <clears throat> Whatever you say. I say I look cool. <laughs> I say I look cool. Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? That is fucked up. <laughs> oh, I know. Anyone but me! Any one of you, but certainly not me. So sure. Made it this far. So have we. I was on my own, though. I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. <laughs> Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Tuh. Lewis. Hey, Actually, I don't like that question. Me to ask. Yeah. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That. Sounds like a rough day. Yeah. Worst day of my life. Thanks, Lewis. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah. It's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Uh, good night. Good night, AJ. Best buds. Long day, huh? Yep, real long. Uh, I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. <laughs> you guys, relax. Get some sleep. Feel human for a night. In the morning, come find me. Is that all we want? This long term. We can stay. We can talk about it. Oh, he's so fucking cute. Oh, nice. That's so sweet. We made friends, everybody. We're good people. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this episode here. Um, normally, I do these things all in one giant episode. Sadly, today, I, I don't have the time to be able to do that. I really wish I did, because I really want to know more of what's going on right now. But I can't. <laughs> and I want to get the- I want to get an episode of it out soon, because it's- I've been kind of delayed on it, so... There you go. But, I like it a lot so far. I like- I like the little story that's going on. I like that it's a bunch of kids trying to figure out what's going on, instead of the kids versus the adults. I like this sort of, like, adolescence kind of coming-of-age story. It feels like watching, like... Yeah, I guess it feels like watching just a movie. Or like an X-Men kind of thing, where you're just watching the kids figure out how to get through crazy scenarios. So, I like that a lot. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face! Like a boss! And, like face on road. Whoosh! Whoosh! But thank you guys, and we'll see all you dudes! Off the air! Oh my darling, oh my darling, oh my darling Clementine